Hello guys, welcome back to Anythingsbo. For today's video, we are going to show you how to create a blog website on Wix. So if you're interested, let's start a tutorial. So in this case, how do we create a blog on Wix? Well, it's actually pretty easy. So let's go ahead and go to Wix.com, log into your account, and you should be able to see the sites page for your account. Now, typically we have the create new site at the top right. So let's go ahead and click on it. And in the create new site, it's going to ask you if you want to create or basically use AI to create your website. So in this case, I don't want to use AI. So let's click on the setup without AI. And from here, let's just go ahead and choose the appropriate options. Now, since we want to create a blog, it is recommended that you click on the option that says blog here or just type in blog. So I'm going to click on blog here. And in this case, it's going to ask you what type of blog that you want to create. Now, depending on what uh, you answer here, the options or the templates that will be available to you later on would actually change. So maybe I want to say I am more in the uh, technology blog here. Let's go ahead and choose that and click on continue. Now, it's going to start preparing your dashboard here, which in this case, uh, you will be able to see or edit a few things. Now, once your dashboard is actually available, it's going to pop up an option here, which in this case, you need to answer a few things regarding your website. So in this case, you need to enter your website here. So for example, I want to say this is going to be a sample blog website. But in this case, you can just enter any name that you want to use. So let's go and click on continue. And from here, it's going to ask you what are your goals for this website. So maybe I want to say I just uh, promote myself and build a community and click on continue. Now, the Wix apps are a great way for you to uh, basically add further functionalities into your website. So like video, events, booking, chat, pricing plans, if you want to add those. But for now, I just want to use the blog option here as well as the Instagram. Let's go ahead and click on continue. Now, in this case, it's going to ask you uh, if you want to start designing your website. So let's go ahead and click on start with the template here. And once you click on it, it's going to ask you what type of template you want to use. Now, there's going to be a lot of templates that you could choose from, as you can see on my screen now. Again, depending on how you answered on the first question, the templates that will be available to you would actually be different. For, for example, I want to use this one. So let's go and click on edit. And it's going to apply that specific template into my website. And once it's actually applied, we are now ready to start editing our website. Now, if you want to add other elements or new elements, typically at the left panel in this section here, as you can see right now, uh, this is where the uh, tools or the different settings that we could actually uh, go around or uh, add them. In this case, if you click on add elements here, you have the option to add like images and text. If you see this, just click on X and stop right here. Click on add elements here and you have the option to add text, images, button strip, decorative box gallery. If you want to add sections, go to the section section here. You could either add a blank section or even a pre-made section here if you want to. Now, you also have the pages if you want to edit the other pages that you have right now on your website or create a new menu item or a new page here. This is where you'll be able to add them. You also have the site uh, team or site design here if you want to change the team colors. And the app section, my business, the, uh, the option for uh, media and the CMS section. Now, in this case, there's going to be a lot of functionalities that you could uh, think uh, here with, with the editor for Wix. But I would suggest you to explore them first before actually building your website. Now, in this case, uh, once you're done, you can just click on publish at the top right of your screen to publish your website. And you just need to enter the URL that you want to set for your website. In this case, uh, it's going to automatically set that for you since we already have a name for our website. So sample blog website. And you can just click on view site to view your website. Now, just going back, if you want to complete your Wix website here, you can just go ahead and go back into the Wix section here at the top left. It's going to open up your dashboard here. And in your dashboard, I would recommend you to finish completing the setup section here at the left panel and choose or write the first blog here and get found by Google. So in this case, I would recommend you to also use your own custom domain here if you have any. But in this case, this is what your website is going to look like once you click on the view site option. But that's about it. So hopefully this video was able to help you like and subscribe to NFT Inspo. Thank you for watching.